Wait, what is this? This is what I meant. Look, what the heck? The cat has a butt. He has a butt. All right, guys, today we are at Big Lots here in Canton, Ohio. And yes, it is 40 degrees, and I am in shorts and a short sleeve shirt because I'm a nerd. Look at this right inside the door here. It is a tall, thin Christmas tree that is actually spinning. Look at this, we got a Grinch hat on the top. But yeah, it's on a spinning base here that allows the Christmas tree to just go around and around and around and around. Big Lots always has a ton of Christmas stuff, like right from when you walk in the door all throughout the store. You can see the Christmas trees back here. That's where we're going in just a second, but I wanted to take a look right here. Look at this. It's a Nightmare Before Christmas Santa hat. What the heck? That is pretty cool. We got these stockings here with letters. I'm just, I'm going to be getting sidetracked through this entire video, I can tell you. I love these ornaments that have the plaid. They're wooden, and they have a little plaid on them. That's very cool. But what I stepped over here to see was this. The Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer red nose and antlers that you put on your car. I was actually thinking of getting a wreath for the Hummer, but I just might have to do this. This is cool. Look at these jigsaw puzzles in little tin Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer characters. Look at this, they got Bumble. That is so cool. All kinds of wrapping paper here. Yes, I just want to go through this stuff a roll at a time. They have bigger wrapping paper over here. Three packs. Look at this, we have the popcorn tins here and all kinds of blankets and throws for warm Christmas movie nights. Christmas cards for the ones you love. All right, let's come on back here and check out these Christmas trees because you gotta love the Christmas trees and I love when it's set up where you can actually walk through like a Christmas tree forest. Look at these, these are so awesome. So just looking at these two right here, you guys tell me in the comments and let's settle this once and for all. Do you guys like the colored lights or the white lights? I mean I love them both but I kind of lean towards the white lights. Wait a minute, I walked right past these. Look at this. These are those things that you lay on the uh, on the bottom of your door to block the uh, the breeze from coming through. That's hilarious. Look at that. It's Santa legs in a chimney. And look at this one. It's a cactus. What's it say? Let's get lit. It's a Christmas cactus. What the heck? And what is this one? It's like a is it a it's a gnome. Chillin' with my gnomies. <laughs> Wait, we got a gold one here. What the heck is this? Is that supposed to be like a... That's supposed to be like a wine bottle. Okay. All right, let's just stand back a minute and look at these trees because I just want to look at them and see which one looks the best out of all of them. And right off the bat, I would have to say that I love this flocked one the best over here. I love flocked trees, except for... It doesn't look like anything's coming off of there, but a lot of times that flocking like falls off, gets all over the floor. I haven't pulled out my tree yet at home, but I believe I have a flocked tree. This one kind of looks like it has ice on it. That's pretty cool, I like that. And then here's a tall, thin one. Hmm, I kind of want to get that one for the second bedroom, just because we have a window um, looking outside in the front. And that way you could see the Christmas tree from outside. This one is not a pre-lit tree though, so I would have to get separate lights. Here's a set of three. I think you actually get all three of these in the box for $99. Yeah, it's a three pack. Those look pretty cool. That actually looks like snow on there. These over here are all pretty basic, but they still look pretty awesome. Of course, we have these three down at the end here that look like they have ice and or flocking on them. <laughs> yeah, this whole end here all has like the flocking that looks like snow on them. Those are all the green ones. These are all the snowy ones over here. I really love these. Now look at the difference in these lights. You got these little tiny LED lights here or else you have this kind of lights. These are always a problem, because if one of these goes out, like a whole string of them does. And me no reiki that. Ooh, look at this solid white one over here. That looks pretty cool. I, I, oh, I have one of these. I actually have a solid white one that I set up last year in my office 
with um, those little Spirit Halloween uh, blind pack characters on. I'm going to have to do that again. Look at these little fellows. These ornaments that look like polar bears. That's hilarious. And what is this? Are these supposed to be like bird fellows? Man, you could go broke on ornaments every year. Look at these. They look like penguins. These are ho-ho-ho ornaments with little Santa hats on them. This whole wall is all ornaments up to about right here. Look at this. We have joy looks like uh, snowflakes, only they're wooden. And then we have our red truck that has the trees in the back. I always look forward to seeing these every year. I don't know if these are supposed to be gingerbread men or snowmen. I think they're supposed to be snowmen because they have like the sticks for arms and the carrot nose. It looks like those are made out of corks. Look at this awesome pack right here. I believe these are shatterproof but you got the uh santa's coat in there we got mittens we got snowmen in there candy canes look we got skiing snowmen up here and i always like these the kinds that are clear and they're like an ornament that's filled with stuff you got a little holly branch in there and a little bit of snow in the bottom oh i like these these look like cookies what the heck i think these are made of like foam or something because they're very light and i love these red and white ornaments these are pretty sparkly here red and white over here i like these are these heavy they look no these look like they'd be heavy but they're not oh my gosh what is this polar bears holy crap those are awesome they're actually fuzzy all right let's head back down this way a minute and see what's down here oh yeah we got these little animatronic guys here we got these little light up blow molds up here a uh, nutcracker yeah you can see how he lights up there and then we got this guy, Gingerbread Man. And then we got a snowman. Let's see if he works. Yep, pretty cool. This is cool, light up singing nativity scene. Ooh, it sings Silent Night. We got the baby Jesus there. Thank you, Jesus. They have a whole bunch of these little animatronic guys. Let's try some of them out. Oh, we already saw this one. Well, I saw this one over in uh, Home Depot. He's pretty cool. <laughs> I posted a short about him and somebody told me that he's holding the trombone wrong. Wait, holiday jukebox. I gotta see this one. Okay, jingle bells. Ah, oh, sweet. Silent night. Here comes Santa Claus. Here comes Okay, wait a minute. I can't actually play much of these songs because they're actually copyrighted songs. Gene Autry, Smokey Robinson, Bing Crosby, The Temptations. That is a pretty cool little prop, though. All right, we got a little Frosty the Snowman here. Oh. He just wants to walk right off the ledge. Don't do it. All right, we got a Snoopy animated plush here on his doghouse. I'm assuming that spins if I can figure out. Oh, squeeze, squeeze the hand. What the heck? Okay, here we go. Oh, yeah. That is actually pretty dang cool. Look at the propeller. All right, animated snowman. Let's see what this guy does. Hmm. Oh, speak to me and I repeat oh, what you say. Me. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. I like your nose. I like your nose. I like your carrot nose. I like your carrot nose. <laughs> this is like the repeating ghost that we saw at Halloween. This is like the repeating ghost that we saw at Halloween. All right, here's a reindeer with a gun. I'm actually kind of surprised that they were allowed to put this out. It was the sound of the gun being shot. I have no idea what that song is. Wait a minute, wait a minute. It looks like we have a peekaboo elf here. <laughs> what the heck? What in the world? 
<laughs> Wait a minute, is this a praying bear? It is, it's a praying bear angel. That's cool, he sings Silent Night. All right, one more, let's do the light up, dancing, singing Christmas tree. <laughs> okay, we got these little tiny trees over here, a regular one here. I actually bought one of these, something like it at least, for my front porch in a little crate box like that that lights up because I wanted a, a Christmas tree outside of my porch. But we got a white one, we got a pink one. Is this green? And maybe it's silvery, silvery white, and a little white one, a little green one. Ooh, we got a Grinch blow mold here. This is actually pretty cool. He's holding little Cindy Lou Who's wreath. All right, let's go back down this way and see what they have in the aisles down here. These are cool. They have things where you can set up your uh, bathroom and your kitchen for Christmas. But I like these over here that are more of like the Christmas colors. I have glass sliding doors on my shower, so I can't use shower curtains. However, I could probably hang them and like pull them back on the sides. That would look cool. All right, let's see down here. We have Christmas pillows. What is this? Ooh, a Christmas mug and bowl set. That's actually cool. When you put them together, it makes a full Santa. Tablecloths, table runners. We got all kinds of hand towels for the kitchen. Have a cup of cheer. Oh, this is cool. It's a Christmas countdown clock. You actually move this to show how many days are left, although it would need to be tightened up a little bit. I always love to see the letters to Santa mailboxes here. Yeah, you can have kids put letters to Santa in there and then you open it up and take the letters out. We got all our tree toppers here, stars of different shapes and colors. Well, well, yeah, I guess they're different shapes. Like this one looks like a snowflake and that one looks like an actual star. Tree skirts and stockings here. I like these stockings with the Grinch on them. That's pretty cool. Hmm, what kind of bell is this? Okay, we got these bells here, like the Polar Express bells. Oh, hello, Polar Bear fellows. <laughs> Here's more wrapping paper, gift bags over here, bows, gift tags, card holders if you're giving uh, gift cards. Oh, cool, look at this. It's a Christmas vacation holiday door cover. That is pretty cool right there. Peanuts window clings. No way, look at this. Elf slippers, $25. What size are these? I am very tempted to get the elf slippers. Looks like they only go up to 11 though. I wear a 12, what a bummer. All kinds of Christmas boxes. If you don't actually wanna wrap presents, you can get these and they already look very nice. All kinds of different bows if you wanna put them on your windows or on your tree. This one would be my favorite. Wait, what is this? This is what I meant. Look, what the heck? The cat has a butt. He has a butt. I like cat. This bit of cat. No way. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> that is so wrong. All right, guys, there's just a little look at Christmas at the big lots here in Canton. I was all excited when I started walking out here because I thought it was snowing for a minute, but it's not. What a Christmas bummer. Bummer.